Good morning everyone, this is the Panda Photographer and welcome to the channel and I'm giving you my personal blog for this video here and I want to just update you guys on a few other stuff that I have not talked about in any of my uh, edited videos. Uh, it's Saturday, it's going to be done and storing today so there's going to be a lot of rain today. This is Portland, I'm still in Portland, I'm still waiting to get into Canada but unfortunately they don't have a date when the borders are going to open so i'm going to be stuck in the states a little bit longer than i expected but with that said please do subscribe like and share if you guys want to support the channel and you guys want to help keep this channel alive and keep the lights on here please there's a paypal donation link down in the description below it does help me out but with that said today i got a new table tripod for my h4n pro because this one here is just it's it's old and it's not stable so with that said but yeah i got that today uh i did update in my media pass uh as you can see looks nice uh doing some local photography for a local news agency here for i don't know a few days maybe a couple weeks until i'm here i gotta i gotta survive too just like everyone else right Got to make money. Got to put my skills to work. So this tripod here is like a knockoff of the Colby grid version. But this one was 18 bucks, as you can see. Here is everything that you need to know. And 18 bucks, not too bad. Uh, I actually ordered it last night and it came today. So yeah, Prime membership still kind of works in some places. So keep that in mind. But I always choose the location where uh, the product is actually in where, what warehouse does the product come from. So it's much easier if you do your research that way. But yeah, package is there. This camera bag, the 10B32L, is amazing. It really is freaking amazing. Look at that. I don't even have the ADD in here, but the ADD goes on this side. So when I do have to open the bag up and quickly access the camera, I can access it from the side, which is great. Uh, got the A77 over there. Uh, I switch where I put the speed lights, all right? Uh, rain cover, that's nice. Uh, yeah, but I'm about to take a shower and get ready. But I also want to talk about the Pen and Photographer's new business cards are coming very soon. Um, they're going to look like this, plastic, uh, with QR code, simple, easy. It's going to be front and back uh, with my own work. And uh, yeah, it's going to be high quality, round edges, just like this. But this is from the brand of the tripod. So if you guys want to check it out, you guys can check it out. I'll leave the links to this down in the description below so you guys can go ahead and you guys can make a purchase if you choose to but yep so i'm gonna give these guys an email and try to see if we get some free stuff to review so i can bring you guys more content to see what they have to offer but they do have quite a bit to offer actually so it came in this box this is model bt01 for mobile cameras and uh, GoPros. It's flexible. Action cam out. And you can see here up to five pounds. So keep that in mind. Yeah, so came in this small little box. In the package, it came with this. Now, you normally see these particular foam mounts, but i never seen one like this built really high quality. Like, look how thick that is. <laughs> That's pretty thick. All right. And it came with the action cam mount as well. I have, like, several of these, so I don't really need it. But I'm going to keep it. <laughs> but, yeah, it, it works pretty well. I need a little something a little to elevate to my voice. So... The volume is not tr going everywhere as it was with that table tripod. But with this, this one, if I'm sitting down on this chair here, 
I'm level and I can literally, as you can see, I can literally talk and like, yeah, blah, 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 yeah, blah, blah, blah. You get it, right? Good. All right. So, yeah, it's a overcast day. It's going to rain. Here's the secret garden, the backyard. I'm still in Portland waiting. But I'm, I don't think I'm going to get into Canada. It doesn't look like I'm going to get into it. And I don't think things are going to work out uh, due to the COVID-19 situation. So, uh, you guys have any suggestions where I should go to take some landscape photos? If I don't get into Canada, let me know. I have a couple places in mind. But, you know, I'm going to hear you guys' thoughts and opinions. And I'll probably take a gamble and go for it. So, with that said, everyone, please do subscribe, like, and share. Please do leave a thumbs up. And if you like my personal vlogs, just let me know, all right? Uh, this is a photography log, basically, and uh, let's try to get some stuff done today. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.